everybody, and welcome back to our Origins Summer Preview 2016. I am here with Scott, and we are taking a look at a new uh, upcoming game from Passport Game Studios, Quartz. Yeah, Quartz Thanks. is really exciting. Uh, this is designed by Sergio Halaban and Andre Zatz, yep. who you may know from Sheriff of Nottingham. Mm -hmm. uh, really, really very fun, engaging game. As you can see from the artwork, it looks very different. This is going to be released at Gen Con for us. Okay. Uh, Sergio is actually going to be there at Gen Con too, so if anyone wants to come check it out and meet him, he'll be there at our booth on Saturday. Nice. Um, the idea of the game is very simple. So we are all dwarves living a wonderful, peaceful life, mining all of our gems, uh, and we find a new mine that has all of these new gems in it. Okay. Uh, and I just realized that somebody stole our gems. They're over there. Someone's already in playing the game already. Nice. That's Good all right. Good job. We'll so, get those in a second. We'll get them in a second. The idea of the game is very simple. On your turn, you have two choices. You can either mine for gems in the bags. Let's say you're going to mine. I am mining. You're going to take two gems out one at a time. Bam. All right. I you have a, a white, which is a crystal. All right. Yeah, I got a crystal. And then you have and a purple, yeah. which is an amethyst. All right. That's good. Yeah, good. So you'd put those on your mine cart, and you would be able to save those for future turns. Uh, at the end of the uh, round, when you choose to leave the mine, you're going to be able to sell those depending on the sets that you have. Okay. Like three of a kind, four of a kind, a rainbow of different colors, things like that. Okay. And that seems really easy. But in that bag are also black crystals, which represent obsidian. Which, as you know, if you have a pickaxe, you're going to hit those and it's going to break your pickaxe. If you pull out one obsidian, it's okay, you're still in the game. If you pull out two obsidian, you've broken your axe and you've had a misfortune and accident happen, so you're actually kicked out of the mine, so you're out of it for the round. Okay? Gotcha. So a little bit of press your luck. Well, as you may see, there's also cards involved in the game here too. So what happens is, on your turn, aside from mining, you could choose to leave the mine. And that's where you're going to get to sell your crystals. And if you sell your crystals, you also have an opportunity to buy these action cards, which are going to get used on a future turn. Okay. And they're all variable abilities. Some of them are going to be stealing gems from people. Some are going to let you ignore the effects of the obsidian. All different things to help you out throughout the game or hurt your opponents. And there's two different types. There's action cards, which are blue. There's purple, which are reaction. The reaction cards will help you when someone else tries to play a card on you. Yeah. So per perhaps I saw you take a card that said, I'm going to steal a gem from a player. And then I have a reaction card that says, prevent that. I'm probably going to want to try and go get that to make sure that you don't target me. And you target some other nice man like Sam Healy or something <laughs> like that. Right? So, Bam! That's happening. Really, really fast-paced game. It's something that's really fun because everyone's engaged at the table. It doesn't okay. matter what it is that you're doing. Uh, if you're pulling gems out of the bag, I'm going to want to know what you pull out of there. Um, I think because of these gems being like uh, played with off the, the uh, table here, that someone actually doesn't have the black gems in there. So okay. you, you can probably pull out a bunch here, but in the main game, there's 68 gems in the bag, and 18 of them are obsidian, which are the, the bad ones. So gotcha. you got some statistics that you can play with there as to you know how many gems are already out, am I gonna get caught with a bad one, do I wanna press my luck, or do I wanna jump out, get some of these. It's played over five rounds or five days, so you'll be able to do uh, track that along the board. And at the end of the five days, whoever has the most money from selling your gems is gonna become the new owner of the mine in quartz. So super fast, plays in like 30 to 45 minutes, nice. three to five players, and it'll be out at Gen Con for only $29.99. $29.99. $29.99, yes, Pretty but cool. for you, $29.99. So. <laughs> yes, it, it's a special. I'm going to Gen Con The Z now. special. <laughs> I'm going to be there now. Yep. <laughs> well, very cool. Thanks for showing it to us. Anytime. Thank you. Good talking to you. Appreciate and it. Thank you, folks, for tuning in. We'll see you next time.